In this video I'm going to show you how to set up Microsoft's Enhanced Mitigation Experience Toolkit on Windows 7 64-bit. So after you've downloaded and installed it, go to your Start menu and then All Programs and you'll have an Enhanced Mitigation Experience Toolkit folder and then click on Emmet. And it needs admin privileges so click on Yes on this prompt. So we have system-wide mitigations and per application based mitigations. First thing we want to do is click on configure system and we're going to change our depth mitigation to application opt out. There is a profile name that is called maximum security settings that is more secure than what we're going with here but for application compatibility reasons we're not going to do that so just click OK and then go and click on configure apps go up to file menu, click import, double click on our C drive, go into program files, Emmet, deployment, protection profiles, and double click on all. So what this has done has added a bunch of popular applications to Emmet with the already recommended mitigation settings. You'll notice that some of these are unchecked because the application is not compatible with that specific mitigation. And this list has all the major web browsers, several versions of Microsoft Office. It has Photoshop, Adobe Reader, Java. But if there's something that's not in this list that you want to add, just go ahead and click on the Add button. Double click on our C drive again, go into Program Files. And for this example, I'm going to use a PDF viewer called Sumatra PDF. So I just go into that folder and then select the Sumatra PDF application. And that adds it to the bottom of the list, and by default it has all the exploit mitigations checked. You'll want to keep them all checked unless you find out that the application is not compatible with one of them, and then just go ahead and uncheck this specific mitigation that's not compatible. Then just click OK. And close Emmet by clicking the X. And it warns us that we need to reboot our computer before the changes take effect. So go ahead and click OK and reboot your computer and you have successfully deployed Emmet. Thanks for watching.